Yeah, sorry to pull you away from your <clears throat> shopping. Dude, I'll be honest, things definitely matters. Uh, ranks a bit higher. I over, know. Uh, but shopping, man. Yeah, I know. She just mm. didn't sound like she was doing well. She asked me to close down the daycare, and that's not super common for her unless, like, something actually bad is happening. And she sounded not her usual self. <sighs> Earth, we up there, honey? Yeah. You mind if I come up? No. Is that a no, don't come up, or no, you don't mind? No, I don't mind. Am I okay to come up, too? Yeah. I don't think I've been here yet. You haven't been here? I don't think so. Yeah, you you haven't. I could show you two or later. Hey, honey. That's a new sight. Hi. You hey, right? Hi. No. What's going on, baby? Well, it might be silly. Go for it. Mm -hmm. Well, you'll also be mad. Uh, we promise we I'm won't sure be, I'd be mad. mad, but no, you're not gonna be mad at me. I just know you're gonna start getting angry. We promise we'll hold off on our anger until we're somewhere else. Yep. Okay. So <clears throat> Nexus came by. Okay. How so? He sent a robot and was talking to me through it. That makes <laughs> sense. Okay. <clears throat> Right. And he was saying stuff, and we talked, and then he left. What did he say? He didn't touch you? No, he didn't touch me. He didn't hurt me. Just, I guess he kind of did mentally, you know, because I'm not really doing hot right now. Where's Daisy? Under the covers with me. Oh, okay. He just said a lot of stuff. And, you know, I've been trying to work on being a stronger person, and I don't know, it kind of got to me, is all. Uh, what... what do they say to you, honey? It's mostly about expectations, and, you know, how people don't actually really like me that much, and... That's a lie. Well, that was kind of it, too. Mostly, too, about, like, uh, all I'm good for is, you know, venting on. And that's, and, you know, it's kind of coincidental or kind of weird. Everybody kind of accepted me right away. And, you know, mentioned Monty, too, about, you know, falling in love with me so quick when he, he didn't really know me and stuff like that. And, you know, I don't fully believe it all. It's just, you know... I'm already insecure as it is, and that didn't help me. Okay. <sighs> you know what... You know what he was saying was just... to get to you, right? I know Nexus is a sad person, and I feel bad for them, but I also feel bad about, you know... I don't like being mean. Even when it's warranted, because then I feel bad afterwards. And, you know, it's just a whole mess. Right. He did offer. That, that was his whole offer, by the way, of, you know, me joining him. And, you know, I can, you know, control everybody's expectations of me or whatever he said. And I said no. And he left. Okay. Yes. Left? Yeah, he said that I'll have to die, and then he left. Gotcha. So, more threats, more stuff like that. Um, is there anything you'd like? Ice cream? Like? No. Cook? Okay. I'm good. I'll just lay here a while and uh, think. Where's Daisy? I want to. They can sit on the edge of the couch here. I don't want to the bed. I don't want to crush her. Yeah, she's probably between her legs. Yeah, she's right there. Okay. I'll just... Honey. Yeah. 
He's just trying to get in your head, you know that, right? Yeah. But if you still make you feel bad? Yeah. Is there anything you want me to get for you? No, it's okay. I just wanted to let you guys know that that happened. And, you know, I'm not feeling great about it. And, you know, I'm not upset at you guys or anything. It's just, you know. Anything you might want to ask us? I don't know. It's a lot of my insecurities right now. And I don't want to have well, you guys deal with that, so. Earth. You help people a lot. The least we can do is help you, too. I know. I want to tell you something. When I came back, Monty and Son were some of the first people I saw, and I met you for the first time. I had nothing to go off of aside from what I'd been told by Monty, Sun, Lunar, that you were a nice, caring, overall amazing sister, partner, person. And I can pleasantly say you are the nicest, most amazing person I have ever had the pleasure of meeting in my life. Thank you. And I say that with utmost confidence. Thank you, Moon. Of course. And maybe when you got here, there was some form of expectations I know before I disappeared into my own head. All I knew about you is that you were made by the creator. Of course, me and son with our experiences that put a negative connotation in our minds. That's just because of him. And then you got here and from what I heard, you were just you instantly reached out to help son and he blew up the mana pool and I never saw your old body and, but you are beautiful so I completely understand how Monty would have started falling for you being how nice you are and how beautiful you are and I say that as your brother. And I am happy that my best friend and my sister are so happy together. Thank so you. So Nexus man. can shove it. I know Nexus is just unhappy, and this is the choice that they made, and... You know. <laughs> I'll step out yeah. for a minute and let you guys... Have I'll a take your relationship talk. Right. Uh, anything in the fridge I can chew on? Help yourself. Uh, plenty of stuff. Sandwich. Or you are asking it, you can make a sandwich in there. Awesome. Real simple man to please. Yeah. Alright. Anything you might want to tell me, honey? I know when I first came here, I was very caring and... No, that's not the word, I still am, but... I guess people would call me more maternal. And I like doing that. I like taking care of people. And I still do. But I didn't let people take care of me. 
And now that I'm letting that happen, I feel kind of like we all care for each other and it's all better. But I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Take your time, Earth. I just... We all have expectations on us. Everybody does. <laughs> Guess so. Me and Nexus, we were the... We, we came here together, sort of. I mean, I... I was alive for a lot longer, you know, but... Right. I hadn't interacted with anybody before besides my father, and I wouldn't even really call that interacting. I would do stuff with him, like help him with his experiments and stuff, but most of the time he would just put me in a room and I'd watch movies all the time. That's why I don't really like, you know, do anything else. It's kind of all I do. And... You know, I, I just... Me and him had expectations on us, and we both fed into that for each other. I was expected to take care of him, and he was expected to fix things. And that was okay. And now, after everything that's happened, and I look back, and I tried so hard, I just wanted to make things better for everybody. Yeah. I mean... And I know you guys love me. Oh, you're more than I could ever describe. I know. But Nexus, he did say that... I... You know... I don't believe it at all, but... You know, I would have no choice but to love you, because I have nothing if I don't have you. And it just feels like he was saying that... To himself, in a weird way. Because... He doesn't... Have anything. He just doesn't anymore. Yeah. I don't think he does neither. I mean, he's just got to be God knows where by himself. Working with maybe one other person who's just probably using him anyways. And that's sad. He was my brother once. I know. They could change real fast, even he, for no reason, really. He still called me his sister when he was talking to me, and that's what I'm most confused about, because I just don't understand how you could be okay with somebody potentially dying to your actions and not feel a twinge of regret over it, and then still say that you care about them. I just... <sighs> Don't understand it. It's baffling. Yes. I wouldn't. I I couldn't be able to do that. I couldn't. And if people, you know, like if Sun or or Moon or anybody wants to forgive him at some point, which I doubt they would, but if they did, they know a lot of stuff, honey. I don't think anyone would ever forgive him. I wouldn't. If he tried and was sorry, I don't think I could call him my brother again. But I don't want him to die. I don't want anybody to die. I don't want people to hate me. I don't want people to, you know, think I'm bad. I don't think anyone hates you. I know. He just... Yeah. If anything, I think he just came here to hurt you. 
but it worked. You know I love you, right? And I love you. And you'd have so many friends still. I'd have sun, solar, lunar. More, really? Yeah. If you want to, you can go check in on Moon. I'll be up here for a while. You sure, baby? Yeah. I'll be okay. You don't want me to... Kiss your forehead, or... If you wanna. Maybe tickle you a little? No tickles, please. Maybe a little? No, thank you. I'm gonna surprise you one of these nights. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You just stay there, alright? Okay. If you need anything, come up here. Just ask, alright? Okay, I'll let you know. Are you sure you don't want anything? Not right now. I'm okay. Alright, honey. Maybe some ice cream, actually. Alright, what, what, uh, what kind? Vanilla with chocolate sauce. Oh, it's not hard to get out of you. Alright. Be back, alright? Okay. Okay. Dude! Mm. You raided the whole fridge? No. What kind of cheese do you use? This is great. Uh, you have to ask Earth. It's like goat and, uh, cow cheese or something. It's so creamy. Uh, it, it's something, man. Oh, by the way, we're killing him, right? For a while there, I thought he might have had some pullback, but there was no reason to even go after Earth. Yeah. I don't, I don't even understand what exactly happened there. Mm. <laughs> Why are you at cheese? That thing is like 20 bucks a pound. Looks like I owe you two hundred dollars. Yeah. All right, move over. I gotta get her some ice All cream. Right. So we're killing them, right? I'm trying to like not be bad of a person I was before. Fair enough. Still trying to figure out why he even did any of that. I really can't tell you. I don't understand how he works. <laughs> Probably is upset that she even has anything. If it comes down to it, I'll pull the trigger myself. In all honesty, maybe he does see a par portion of himself in her. Well, how's that? I mean... What, he's tall? Like I her now? They did technically grow up together. Both had expectations shoved on him. <laughs> you wanna? You know my help with anything. I don't know. Just trying to think or something. Okay. I'll leave you be then. You uh, sure? Yeah. I'll head home. I'll update. Oh the God, dang it, son. Oh. She's probably like this. Yeah, probably. I'll go update Lunar and Sun. I'll let them know to probably leave Earth alone for a day or two. All right. All right. Hey, sweetie. Bye, Earth. <laughs>